To my love, Abraham, it's finally here, our wedding day. Just the thought of us finally together makes me feel so excited. It's been great 11 years. We have gone through so much. Good and bad times that have made our relationship stronger. I am so grateful that you are in my life. You are my best friend, the one person I can trust my deepest thoughts, the one person that makes that makes me feel so special. It doesn't care how silly I act. The person that makes me laugh while I try to be mad. I'm so happy that we are finally going to be able to spend the rest of our lives together. I love you with all my heart and will always will. P.S. Congratulations on marrying a hottie from Cynthia. Cynthia, tonight is the beginning of the rest of our lives together. I can't believe how fast time has gone by. It seems like just yesterday we were going out on our very first date. But I am so happy that we are finally here. I know that I sometimes joke around about being worried about marriage, but the truth is, there is not a single bone in my body that is not sure that you are the one that I want to spend the rest of my life with. From the moment we met, I knew that you were, the sp you were a special girl. And every waking second that I have sp had the pleasure to spend with you since then has reassured how special you are to me. From this moment on, I look forward to waking up to your beautiful smile and eyes every morning. I look forward to discovering the world with you. I look forward to growing old with not only the love of my life, but my best friend. And I look forward to doing nothing as long as it is, as long as it is with you. I want you to know that you mean the world to me and my heart is unconditionally yours. I know that tonight it's going to be perfect no matter what happens. It does not matter if the lights mess up or if the food is bad. Having you by my side as my wife is all I need to make my day perfect. I wanted to end this letter by telling you how much I love you, but there are no words in any language that could possibly describe how I feel for you. So until someone invents a word that is stronger than love, I will end it by saying that I love you always and forever.